Hello, my name is Hong Yujun. Today I'm going to go through my tutorial trough for my engineering mathematics tree. So there are two questions total in my tutorial trough. The first question is get and evaluate the this uh, equation where the V is the region that bounded by the plan X, uh, plan X, plan Y and plan Z and the equation of 2x plus y plus z equals to 2 and the f is equal to 2zi plus yk so uh, I sketch already this is the graph then I use the Gauss divergent theorem to solve it which is the integral of the vector f is equals to the double differentiation or double integral of the f ds so they are, they are in they are four surface in total in i i draw it like that so the first surface is the normal is equals to the j so for the double integration the there is no j in this f so there will be zero and the second surface is the normal is negative j so like the same there is no j in this 3d shape so there will be zero and the surface three is the normal is negative i so negative i so uh, substitute in this equation there will be in the grid S3 bracket 2zi plus yk then dot multiplication with i so after the multiplication there will be negative 2z dy dx so double integration of them the uh, limits of y is 0 and 2 and z is 0 as 2 as well so solve it and get the answer of the surface is negative x then for the surface S4, the normal of the surface S4 is negative k. So as you can see, there is go to the go to the uh, negative of z direction. So there will be negative k. So substitute into the equation integration of S4 bracket two z i plus y k dot multiplication with negative k ds. The ds is dx dy. So solve it. And uh, after the multiplication, there will be negative y dx dy. The limit of the x is zero and two, and the y is zero and one. So sorry, the limit of x is zero and one, and the y is zero and two. So solve it. The double integration and get the final of negative two. So. The, the the final answer of the double integration of f ds is negative x and negative 2 then sum it out and get negative 10 as the final answer so now i'll go through the question 2 of so now i'm going to solve my question 2 of my tutorial trough the question 2 is verify the gauss divergent by the uh, shape they given this is the shape the f is and the equation given the f is x i plus 2 j plus z square k so uh, the Gauss divergent theorem is the uh, is this equation the integration of the vector f dv is equals to the double integration of f times the normal ds so now I'm going to solve the uh, integration of v with the vector f. So the vector f will go change to be the divergent of f. Then solve it like the uh, differentiation of the i, j, and k respond responsively. So the i after the differentiation there will be one. 
the y there's no y so uh, will be zero and the z square will be two z then triple in the creation of the equation that given the limit of the x is zero to two the limit of y is zero to two the limit of z is zero to four so solve it and get the final answer of xd so now uh, i'm going to solve the double integration of the cos divergent theorem to prove it so they as you can see there are six five five surfaces in total the s1 the normal is negative k and the z will be zero so there's no z here and no k so the integration will be zero as well now for the surface s2 the normal n is equals to k and the z is equals to 4 because the surface s2 is at a 4 at here so multiply it and get 16 the limit of x will be 0 to 2 0 to 2 and the limit of y will be 0 to 2 as well so we get a final result of 64 now for the s3 S3 is here, the normal will be negative j and the y will be 0 because um, they locate at 0 here. So do the multiplication and get negative 2. The limit of x is 0 to 2 and the limit of z is 0 to 4. So we get an answer of negative 16. Now is the surface 4. The surface 4 is uh, the, the normal is negative i and the x is 0 so as you can see the f is no i there so the integration will be 0 and the last is the surface 5 the surface 5 is uh, the curved surface that had a little bit special cause, because the normal is i and j the normal is uh, have two sides which i and j so do the multiplication after that uh, we will get the finance of uh, get a multiplication answer of 4 the limit of x is 0 to 2 and the limit of z is 0 to 4 so uh, after do the multiplication we will get the answer of x then do the integration get 32 so the sum of the uh, double integration of f with the normal is 64 minus 16 plus 32 and get 80. So like the same as the triple integra integration of the cos divergent theorem, which is xd as well. So the theorem is proved and verified. That's all from tutorial 12. Thank you.